camera lens trained on one man. He scored four in his last three. What will he produce today? Stay with us on EA TV. Hello from the Catalan capital and one of the world's great cities, Barcelona. I'm Derek Ray and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. And we've got quarter-final first leg action from Europe's Premier Club competition, the Champions League, just moments away. It's Barcelona versus Dinamo Zagreb. Well, Derek, I can't see any other result. Barcelona have to win this one. They have better players, more options and a top-class coach. They're a very good team. And they kick off this Champions League quarter-final first leg. Well, this is what we think for Barcelona. Marc-André Ter Stegen starts in goal. Samuel Umtiti plays alongside Clément Langlais in central defence. Memphis plays with Ousmane Dembele out wide. And potentially a real handful in attack today, Sergio Aguero. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Well, we know how troublesome he can be on the pitch, but what should we expect from him today, Stuart? Well, his recent form speaks for itself. Four goals in the last three appearances, and he's been playing with great confidence. There's every chance he'll get another couple today. Barcelona, free kick. It'll be here. Are well, the referee electing not to show him the yellow card, Stuart? And I think it's the right decision. It is a foul, but it doesn't deserve a card. And he's clear as lines. De Jong. Pedri. The pie. That's great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is. He was so alert there. Can someone get on the end of this? Pedri. Busquets. did so well to deny him well Barcelona have to make the most of this dominant period and don't these fans know it just listen to them that's someone to play it to opportunity well over the top it goes he didn't miss by an awful lot Luka Ivanushev. Petkovic. Well, that's how to break the spirit of the attacker. Sergio Busquets. Here's Umtiti now. Aguero. Now with De Jong. Barcelona have given it away. A chopping challenge, and the referee has got to have a big think about it. Well, he's gone into the referee's notebook. And he can't be surprised. That was a poor challenge, you have to say. Ariana Demi. Possession changing hands. it through he might profit from here you know oh brilliant goalkeeping he's driven in the corner great reflex action well that should have been a goal mind you it's a brilliant save And over it comes. Just the clearance that was called for. Pedri. De Jong. 
cuts it back. There is the goal to open the scoring. Who can say they don't deserve to be in front? Well, here we can see it again. He's shown outstanding vision to find the perfect cutback. But when he shoots, I expected him to go across the goalkeeper. He should never beat the goalkeeper inside that near post. That's not good keeping. continues his run well nothing comes of it it looked promising Frankie de Jong here's Umtiti now well, possession is the watchword inside their own territory good tackle it'll be a throw Sergio Busquets Aguero. Excellent vision. Tempele. De Jong. Busquets. Here's Aguero. And saved by the keeper. And a throw in forthcoming. And they have possession again. Samuel Umtiti. On to Aguero. Not a fantastic piece of defending, was it? Once again, couldn't keep hold of it. Aguero. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. Body on the line. And a decent save. Full credit. Well, the first 45 minutes have come and gone here in Catalonia. Well, Usman Dembele stamped his authority on the first half. What did you make? And so they kick off the second half in this Champions League quarter-final first leg. Dembele. Promising move from Barcelona. And there the attack ends for now. Mišić. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. Sergio Busquets. Pedri. Jordi Alba, fine sequence of passes. Aguero. And he's in. And the ball is loose. Oh, not to be. That would have put them well on their way, Stuart. Well, that could prove to be a big miss. Surely has to score there. And they deal with the threat this time. Aguero. Tempele. Here's Aguero. 
Coutinho. It's in. They're looking really relaxed and confident and not giving the opposition much of a look in. Well, just look at this. It's a good finish and reward for their pressure. They really have controlled this game. So, 2-0 now. 30 minutes to go, then. And the emphasis is on creativity. But nothing comes of it. away by Barcelona options in the centre splendid tackle and the outcome is a corner here and they're going for the short one firing it in the keeper diving magnificently to make sure he got there substitution time it is so a corner here it's a short one promising move well bizarre circumstances really the block by his own teammates offside the final decision Stuart yeah he's frustrated that his teammate is offside there but it wouldn't have beaten the keeper anyway I think he had it covered Sergio Busquets Dubai to attack from the wide areas space and time for the cross Aguero fluency of movement Depay really vital interception here well not cleared away completely and the pass could do damage and he's through a goal! That's exactly what they needed. That should get them believing again. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. So back underway at 2-1. Tight contest here. Well, they're quite content to knock it around inside their own half. Must be! It's still alive! And he clears it out of harm's way. Well, just listen to the noise in here. These fans are doing everything to get their team over the finish line. And there's not long left now. Aguero. Well, he's lost it. Losing possession here. Longley. Jordi Alba. And now Coutinho. Well, you can absolutely sense the frustration growing in the opposition camp. They can't get near the ball. Not much defensive cover there on the flank. And just over the bar, really good effort. Fine reading of the situation. Sergio Busquets. Aguero. And return to Coutinho. Danger averted. So two minutes of stoppage time here. Goyak. 
Well, the pass not finding its target. That's all there is time for the full time whistle. And Barcelona with the lead going into the second leg of this tie. Well, I thought they were the better side. They controlled the flow of the game and looked dangerous going forward. But they'll need to perform just as well in the second leg to go through.